U.S. Marines based in Okinawa, Japan, linked up with French Marines for partnered training on the island of Guam. There's a language barrier, but you overcome it over time. It's kind of a general human communication really helps. The exercise is called Jeanne d'Arc, or as we know it, Joan of Arc, named after the famous French heroine and warrior who was martyred in 1431. It's a French-led four-month exercise aimed at strengthening ties and freedom of navigation operations in the Indo-Asia-Pacific region. Military planners say this is the first time in recent memory that NATO troops have come to Guam for partnered training with U.S. Marines. About 100 Marines from 3rd Marine Expeditionary Force were embarked on a French naval amphibious ship and participated in field training at a makeshift mount town at Anderson Air Force Base. They practiced foot patrols and clearing buildings. Despite language barriers and cultural differences, these Marines found they have more in common than they realize. French and U.S. Marines have the same uh, warrior spirits. Jean d'Arc 17 continues later this week with Marines making an amphibious landing on the small island of Tinian in the Commonwealth of the Northern Mariana Islands. Reporting from Anderson Air Force Base, Guam, I'm Amy Forsyth. Defense media activity in Guam covers military news and information you won't find anywhere else. Like us on Facebook and subscribe to our YouTube channel.